myself Kyas, aptitude trainer at SP Global Solution Branch Hyderabad. Today I am just explaining the important technique for changing any decimal number or recurring number or bar number into the fraction. How can we change the given number into a fraction? So just see on the board. So this is the one 0.05. We have to change this number, decimal number in a fraction. And this 1.25, this is 0.5. Bar means the 5 is repeated any number of time, that is 0.555 and so on. Similarly, 0.05, both digit have bar. Here, 0.25, only 5 have bar. Here, 1.25, only 5 have bar. So, add there is 6 question. Now, you see the first question. The first question is 0 0.05. That is the first question. And this is first question is 0 0.05. We have to change this number into a fraction. So what is the rule? Just to see that there is not any digit. That is the zero is a digit and no other zero number except zero. So 0 0.05 for point. There is a one and zero five. So write only this is 5 upon 100 that is 0 0.05 remove the decimal and for removing this decimal there is a 5 and after decimal 2 digits so 2 zero. okay and 0 0.5 means only 5 so 5 by 100 is characterized. If you can see now this 5 by 100 then you get 5 by 5 5 to the also correct answer. So 5 by 100 and 1 by 20 is right answer. So you can write answer that is 5 by 100 or 1 by 20. This is correct answer. In the same way we have the second question 1.25. So in the second question this is 1.25. So 1 is complete. Okay and 0 0.25 means that is 1 and 25 by 100. So 1 and 25 by 100 you can write 1 plus 1 and 25 by 100. So this 1 is complete and 0 0.25 is 1 for point that is 1 and after 2 degrees so 2 So 1 and 25 by 100. So you can write this number for 100 and 125. So you can write 125 by 100. So you can write direct from this also 1.25. So write, just remove the decimal. So and for decimal, there is a 1 and after decimal 2 decimal, so 2 zero. So this is 100. So 125 by 100 is characters. But there is a common factor, so you cancel out the common factor. So 25 4 to 100 and 25 5 to 125. So your correct answer is what? 5 by 4 is correct answer. So 1.25 can easily be written as 125 upon 100 or simply 5 by 4. So technique is simple. Write 1 to 5 all numbers, remove decimal. For removing decimal, there is your point. And after decimal 2 digits, so 2 0, so 125 by 100 is carried. Now, if there is a common factor, then cancel out. So 25 is a common factor, 25 to the 100 and 25 by the 125. So 5 by 4 is carried answer. Now, the most important word is 3 and what is going to be taking this. So third one is what? 0 0.5 bar. So 0 0.5 bar means that 5 digit is repeated many number of times. You can say 0 0.5555 and so on. So what is the trick of this type of number? So write uh, before decimal there is a 0. So 0 have no meaning. After decimal there is a 1 digit and 1 bar. So your answer is 5 upon 9. So what is the technique? The technique is that the after decimal. How many digit have one? So one digit has one. So digit upon one. So five by nine is correct answer. This is your answer in the fractional form. 
so 0.55 entirely we can have only 5 by 9 because there is a 0 before decimal so it have no meaning and after decimal 5 part so this is 1 by 5 and so 1 part so that is not 5 by 9 characters in the same way 0 0.05 so the fourth question our fourth question for 0 0.05 and what does it have now? so process is same what is the process that write all the numbers that is 0 0.05 remove this one so you will take 0 0.05 and now two digit have bar so 2 9 so 0 0.05 is only 5 so this is 5 by 99 is character so there is a simple way write the numbers after decimal all numbers and see how many digit have bar two digit have bar then we take 2 9 so 0, 05 by 99, 0, 05 is only 5, so 5 by 99 is correct answer. So here your answer is what? Only 5 upon 99. This is correct answer. In the same way, you see the fifth one. That is a fifth one is most important. That is 0 0.25. Every question has a different word here. Both is here only one bar. Two digit bar here, two five. One half bar, only one, one digit half bar. So that's why you can write this question how that is zero two five, that is a uh, twenty five. And just subtract the number which have no bar. So two have no bar, that is twenty five minus two. And one digit have bar, so one nine. And this digit have no bar, so no bar have zero. So that means concept is that it does how many digits have bar. One digit have bar, then there is a one line, and one digit have no bar, so there is a one zero. So write all numbers and subtract the digit or number which have no bar and divide it by the number of bar nine and zero number of not bar. So one digit have no bar, so one zero, and digit have one bar, so nine. So write first nine and then zero. So your correct answer is what? That is 23 by 9 is correct answer. So this answer is that you can write that is 23 upon 9. You can do by simple 25 minus 2. That is 23, 1 by 9 and this is So you have seen that is the first question, second question, third question, fourth question and five question. Now there is a sixth question. So, six question is what? That is 1.25 and this 5. So, you have understood all these 5 questions in different different. So, now you can solve this question very easily by adopting applying the same technique. So, this is homework for you. Let's solve this question and go for comment your correct answer. What is your correct answer? And subscribe my channel as to Global Solution Channel and with the bell that is why we are uh, uploading uh, every day there is a new technique. So you just uh, subscribe my channel. Thank you.